in the game of tug of war. The heart was being pulled one way and the other. One side was eventually going to win out. One side was going to get the heart. In our tree Bible story this morning, Achan's heart was being pulled one way and the other. In our story last week, when God's people attacked Jericho, God commanded his people not to take anything that was devoted to God. These things belonged to him. Achan knew what God wanted, but when he saw what belonged to God, the, the robe, the silver and the gold, his heart was drawn to them. God told him to go one way, but Achan wanted to go his own way. His heart was in a tug of war, and sadly, when it came down to it, Achan loved the silver and gold more than he loved going God's way. This morning, in our groups, we're going to be learning that our hearts are in a tug of war. We know that we should be following God's way, and often that's what we want. But all too often, we go our own way. We know that God wants us to obey our parents, but playing that one more game on the Xbox just seems much more fun. We know that God wants us to be kind and generous, but that chocolate bar would be much, much better if it was in our tummy. There's a tug of war in our hearts. God wants us to know that following him is always good and it's always better. God wants our hearts to be for him.